going on guys welcome back for another episode of rise of civilizations all right so we are let me see let's pick up where we left off let's enter our base all right so we're still base level 10 which is fine yeah city hall number 10 here now this thing keeps on messing up i don't get this all right so there we go all right so we've been doing a lot of upgrades and a lot of stuff like that, guys. So it's pretty amazing. So let's see if there's anything else that we can do besides collect the rewards and all that kind of stuff like that. Because I want to grow. I want to make my troops strong. Who doesn't? So let's pick up all this stuff here. So activated kingdom buff. So he had a kingdom buff here. So greetings, governors. King UCS has um, end day has activated kingdom buff. Make good use of it while it lasts. Mobilize war, increasing troop training speed for ten hours, or ten percent for ten ten hour four hours. Ooh, I think we might have missed that one. Sigh. All right, so I don't know if there's anything that we can up. Oh, we can upgrade their stables and stuff. All right, so that's what we're gonna do. Let's go ahead and get this thing upgraded. All right, so nine to ten. Let's go ahead and upgrade those guys now. And let's look right at these ones right here. So, the guy get the lumber mill up too. Damn. Always gotta do something else before you do something else. So, I'll go and hire the second builder. Go ahead and get that going right there. And we're gonna go ahead and cook up some more troops. All right, so we got the tier twos now, guys. Now, if there's something you guys probably don't know, now if you don't know how to upgrade your troops, instead of having to make fresh ones, which it's always good to have diversity in your troops, you can always upgrade them, and you have to do research for that. All right, so what you're gonna do is click on your actual whatever building you're trying to do, like the barracks or uh, whatever you're trying to get, archer training. You're gonna click on it, and you're gonna go back to the previous actual character. All right, and then you're gonna have like the little uh, yellow orange arrow up to upgrade. And you're upgrade your your from your tier one to tier two. So now we got the bowman. All right. So that's how that one works there. And we're gonna do the same thing with the stables, guys. I'm gonna click on the actual like if you're gonna go ahead and train. Um, you see that as the tier two's highlighted, you're gonna highlight tier one. Hit the yellow um, the arrow up, and upgrade. So I have a lot of troops to upgrade, guys. I'm not necessarily gonna upgrade all of them, but I'm gonna go upgrade a few. Okay. So let's go ahead and upgrade these guys right here. All right, so let's upgrade from tier one to tier two. So instead of having the battering ram, we're gonna have the acuballista, arcuballista. It's only an hour twenty three minutes just to get those upgraded, and it's gonna be pretty good after it's done. So it's it's a good thing to have troops that are upgraded. All right, so let me look at my research real quick and see exactly what we do have um, to upgrade right now for as military uh, technology goes. All right, so we're doing pretty good on our military tree right now, guys. Not so much doing so good on the on the uh, farming or economic technology. We're not struggling on it, but we're not doing as good. Um, metallurgy allows troops to gather gold on the map. Okay, we don't really need that right now. We do, but we don't. Actually, how long does that take? Oh, we need to get the academy to level 10 anyway, so we're kind of halted on that either way. So let me see. Increase troops wood gathering on the map. Increase building speed in your city. We do need that. But let me look at my military really quick, guys. I want to make sure my military is strong like it is already. Okay. Prove fetching attack of archer units. Now, we want to make them strong so we can keep on attacking the uh, barbarians. But I think we're doing okay. We're doing so-so, so-so. All right. So, we're going to go with the uh, economic for now, guys. Going to go ahead and rack that up. Um, for the sickle, it's going to increase uh, troops' food gathering on the sp speed on the map. That's only 13 minutes. So, why not? Let's do this. Let's get this done. All right, so I think that one's done. I think. It's only 13 minutes, man. Why not? All right. So definitely want to make sure we get that. We make sure we get the wood. So we can get some wood um, gathering. Because right now it's pretty slow. We're almost at a million. Not bad. All right, so let's go do some kills on the map here, guys. Some kills on the map. I hope that does help you guys out as far as upgrading your troops. I know some people probably didn't know you can do that. So instead of waiting for all your troops to die and then starting over from scratch, all you got to do is upgrade them. And that's all. That's a good thing right there. You can't beat it. Can't beat it with a stick, man. Jeez. All right, so I don't remember what tier we were on. Oh, nine. I think we're killing nines, I think. 
I think so. So tier nines. All right, so let's go ahead and get the All right, so we got Boudica. So they automatically went straight for Boudica. So we're going to go ahead and put Boudica out there. All right, so let me see. We got that. Okay, so we're going to keep on. I guess Boudica's doing a good job, guys. Boudica's amazing. So we're going to stick with her for a little bit. Actually, yeah. Barbarians, attack, rinse, and repeat. Alright, so Alright, so that was done. And we're still on good we have good stamina. Now honestly what I want to do, let me go back and uh, see if I got some of my tier twos in here. Because we do have some tier twos, guys. We're gonna start going with the killing the level tens. And I just want to make sure I can kill as high as I can without putting too much of a damper on my on my troops and healing and all that other stuff like that. So let's go back to... Actually, no. We don't need to do this. What am I doing? What am I doing? All right. So let's go. Tier 10. Let's get it. Tier 10. All right. So we do have some Tier 2s in there, which is great. All right. So let's try it. We can only fail. All right, so it looks like we killed it. Hell yeah. All right, so we got that first kill, I think. Let me see. Let's go back to the gathering port. Go through these reports. All right, so we got our first um, battle with 10 Barbarian. Nice. All right, so we got that. Research report. We got to do that. Researches. Let's go ahead and clean up these rewards real fast. Let's go here, fast. So, let me see. All right, so, yeah. I'm so excited that we can kill the, the, the level 10s now. Hell, yes. We probably can kill 11s, but we're going to stick with the 10s for now. Keep on upgrading our troops and going from there. All right, so Boudicca is going to go ahead and kill all these. Okay, so we got command power 6,100. Total power is 34,231. All right, so we're good with that. All right, so this is a pretty easy, clean sweep, guys.
Yep. Pretty pretty ecstatic about it. I'm so good. I'm so glad. All right. So let's kill these level. There's tier tens. I need to really look at the rewards. What are we really getting from these barbarians, guys? All right. So they're giving us a system here. We're getting supply boxes. Um. All right. So we're getting. All right. So we're getting some lumber, some speed ups. That's all they give us, and we're getting some experience and ordinary starlight sculptures. So we got those. Yeah, this is an easy, clean sweep, guys. We are murdering these troops. Or we're murdering his troops. Yes, yes, yes. All right, so... And another thing with the heroes, the commanders... Yeah, we have all these ones, and I did make the mistake and do the, the stars up, but I don't know. I don't think that was a mistake. I think make a star up is good. But some people look at some other videos. They say, do not star up your characters. And I don't really know why, to be honest with you. I'm going to play this game how I feel. If it makes it make sense, I'm going to do it. All right, so right now we can actually upgrade Centurion. Um, so let's go ahead and get his skills up. Let's upgrade. All right, so we got that. Um, hmm. All right, so that one is leveled up. And he says, don't hit the star button. It's like, I guess, unless you get the actual, I don't know. I didn't just level some bodunk, raggedy um, characters anyway. I leveled the good ones up, basically. I think the ones are good. So let's go for another. I think we could probably try 11. Let's try a level a level 11. Because if we can kill level 11, that means we can double up our troops on the tier 10s. So Boudica, do us proud. All right, so these tier 11s are just a little bit further away. All right, we got to keep on healing our troops, too. As a matter of fact, we don't want to forget these guys. Because we're going to take a lot of damage. All right, good. We got most of our troops already in there. All right, so, yeah. This is great. But, yeah, I just want to show you guys how you can upgrade your troops and go from there. Uh, but still, you know, that's not, the, that's not the end of the battle. You still got the battles halfway won. All right, so I'm just waiting to see if we can kill a level 11. But I see a lot of people are playing this game now. And I'm pretty excited about it. I just wish it was more... When I first started playing the game, I wish it was much more um, popular back then. See, back then, everybody would just go through and they would attack you. Like, you'll just be sitting there chilling out, and all of a sudden you come back and your, your base is raped up real fast, you know? But now it's like, they make it to where you have to play as an alliance. You can't just go out there rogue and just go buy, do your own thing. You can't. I mean, you can, but you really can't. So it looks like we're still fighting. Ooh, this is going to be tough. Actually, we're still going to win, though. I think we're still going to win. It's going to be a, a tough one, man. But I'm still going to stick with the level 10. Because, yeah, we're going to stick with that. Because I know for a fact we can kill those guys and not have any issues at all. A couple more hits and these guys are dead. There we go. All right, so we can take tier, uh, the level 11. So I'm pretty excited about that, too. All right. Receive supply box. Oh, it just erased everything. All right, so they did some server maintenance, and we got 200 gems. I will take every gem they give me, guys. Now, I am right now, I want to switch to a different nation. I don't know which one I should pick. Maybe German. That's probably what I want to do. Or I don't know. Because right now, we're not Ch Are we Chinese? What are we right now? I don't honestly know. Um, Chinese or Japanese? Oh, Korean. We're Korean. That's what it is. We are Korean, and it's okay. Like, it's so-so. But it's not really what I think I want to I want to keep. So I, I probably want to go Jap, uh, Korean, uh, Japanese, not Japanese, uh, German or something like that. Look at all these claimables that we can get, guys. All these things are claimable. All this free stuff. And we're not even done yet. Look at all this. Man, this is the good old massive chest opening at its finest. All right, so there we go. So we still got to get these other ones. These ones all expired. Unfortunately, I missed out on a bunch of chests. Not a whole lot, but I, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So I missed out on about 14 chests. Not a big deal. Because I wasn't even on. This is like during the day. So these are applicants. I'm not going to, I'm not even fighting with that kind of stuff. That's not my job. I'm just here to play. Let someone else do the, um, the honors there. All right, so city construction is what they want us to donate to. Now, this further increases alliance members' building speed in the city. So I guess that's each and everybody's individual um, 
spaces that they can upgrade their own stuff, which is great. Um, all right, so yeah, I'm not doing any approvals, not doing anything like that, guys. I'm just not doing it. All right, so this is pretty much it, guys. Hopefully this was informative for you. It should have been, because I know this is some information that I've never seen online. So I'm giving you guys everything raw, basically. All right, guys. Um, you can follow me on Twitter. You can follow me on Twitch. Hopefully you guys can follow me on Twitch, because that's where we're going to start live streaming regularly. Um, you can also follow me on Facebook. I'm looking to make another page, but I think the one we have right now is working pretty good as much as I can. And I definitely get you guys, uh, if you guys message me, I message you back as fast as possible. You know, within like a 24 hour period at least, but pretty sometimes like a couple seconds. I get you guys whenever I can. All right, guys, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video, guys. Peace.